The passage chosen for today's devotion from Bible is 1 Samuel, chapter 17, verses 1 to 27. Yesterday, we saw David through the eyes of others, initially sidelined even by his own father. His talents in God's presence with him gradually become more apparent. It is ironic that Saul, disturbed perhaps by his conscience and his rejection by the Lord as king, finds comfort through the very person who will replace him. In today's reading, we hear from David himself. But first we observe again perspectives impressed by outward appearance rather than the heart of the matter. Goliath, the Philistine warrior, has an awe-inspiring build and an impressive arsenal, striking fear into Israel's ranks. Overcoming such a giant seems an impossible task. Even Saul seems defeated, once again confirming that he is missing the very ingredient needed in Israel's king. A perspective from God, David, on the other hand, brings just such a perspective. The crux of the matter is not simply a belittling of one army by another. In the ancient world whichever army won the victory had the stronger gods, so the pagan giant taunts the armies of the living God, and thereby defies the Lord himself. When we are confronted by giants whether they be suffocating financial pressures obstacles in the way of healing a relationship or physical illness we too need to seek the Lord's perspective. We can all feel overwhelmed when we look at the outward appearance of things and we can question God's power to help us but the eyes of faith see a different reality. Whether the outcome is what we hope for or whether we need to learn new attitudes by what we go through, we can know that God is with us and for us. Are there any giants in your life? What might God be saying to you about them? Lord, help us to see your perspectives on our lives.